What's up people, hope you're having an awesome day. I'm your host Eamon Hassan and welcome back to another video here at Most Amazing Top 10. Now today's video is a bit of a fun one despite the title. Now for all you avid memers out there, the new thing going around on Twitter and Instagram is hearing a picture that has no sound. Now the meme will be like, for example, those two strong ass magnets that come together and you just know exactly what that coming together sounds like. It's like just etched into your brain. Another one is like a gif of those springy door stoppers being flicked and automatically I'm just thinking of the annoying sound that makes and this is actually recent for me because my cat likes to flick mine all the bloody time I know these are the funniest examples of the meme, but you get the gist so welcome to top 10 scary pictures You can hear starting us off with number 10 is the exorcist woman now I know for a fact almost 90% of us have been screwed over by this woman and her piercing scream I remember when I first encountered her like it was a yesterday Basically my sister wanted me to look at a timed picture on the computer and and tell her what the odd thing out was in the photo. It's honestly like a stream within mountains and when the timer was coming to an end, I was just expecting the image to kind of just go away and then before it even went off, this woman's face just popped up screaming and I had a heart attack. It's just this high pitched annoyance and I can't tell you how many times I've seen her in a video that I'm watching and every time after I'm just like, why? I hate my life, I, I still get scared. She crops up multiple times a year for me I feel and I dare you to comment if you've never Ever had to encounter her. That's a blessing, people. You are blessed. Coming in at number nine is Jaws. Now, I actually cannot with this one. I feel like anytime I've seen this picture anywhere, the whole movie comes right back to me, not just the sound. Guys, this has actually been the soundtrack of my life. I kid you not. This is the reason I have such a phobia of sharks and swimming anywhere. Like, as soon as I enter the pool, I can hear the sound. And the worst part is that it starts playing when the shark isn't even close to the victim. It's just like shadily coming from a distance at this point and then the music is getting faster until it finally rips the person off their surfboard and eats them. Worst part, how the water just goes red afterwards like just stop adding insult to my injury. Yes, my injury, not the shark attack victims, mine. This is personal. Dun -dun, dun -dun. Dun -dun 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 -dun. <laughs> At number eight, we have Jigsaw. If you haven't seen the Saw movies, you're amongst a lucky few, honestly, but for the rest of us, I'm pretty sure Jigsaw's face has literally scarred us forever. So basically, to summarize, Jigsaw is the main character of the Saw movie franchise, and he is the bad guy, just let me be clear. And instead of killing his victims outright and getting it over and done with, he traps them with each other and puts them through every kind of torture you can imagine. The scene that's honestly stuck in my head this whole time is when two people are locked in separate jails but can see each other and then they both have a weighing scales right in front of their bars and the game is whoever's scale is the heaviest when the timer goes off gets to survive. You know what they started doing? They started cutting off their own body parts to put them on the scale. I don't even know which movie that's from, I stopped watching after that one honestly. But before anything, before everything, when you see Jigsaw's puppet mask, you know what's about to come next. Hello, I want to play a game. Filling our number 7 slot is Anne Robinson and I know this one will be more relatable for our British viewers than our other ones but just bear with me. And I asked around the office actually and most people hadn't heard of The Weakest Link but Rebecca and Jack had so I was like ooh, hit or miss, what should I do? Either way, Anne Robinson was the biggest hard ass of the early 2000s. The Weakest Link was basically a TV trivia game show based in the UK and there are a bunch of contestants standing on their podiums in a circle around Anne and they're all sort of working together to win as much money as possible possible. At the end of each round, they all vote on who the weakest person was answering the questions and they leave the show. This honestly gets emotional sometimes, like it's not a joke, but the best part of each episode is Anne because she's just a straight savage. She'll be having a normal conversation with a contestant and then 30 seconds later turn into a robot and be like, you are the weakest link, goodbye. Now at number 6 is the pirate. I don't even have to introduce this man or pirate, I don't even have to say what show he's from, you guys already know. If when you look at this picture, you don't hear, are you ready kids? Then there is something seriously wrong with you. But also this, this whole thing is just questionable, where did this pirate come from? And pirates are usually fearsome and scary, so what is this man's link with Spongebob and my dear Patrick? Should kids be trusting a random pirate on TV that they don't know? Probably not. And since when did the FDA approve pineapples living under the sea? Something's just not right here, which is why this image just rubs me the wrong way. Coming in at number 5 is Static, and I don't know who has cable 
illegal anymore, honestly. I feel like we're in the era of Netflix and illegal streaming, lol. But either way, if you did have cable as a child and there was a storm one night or there were certain channels your cable didn't have, this bad boy would come straight up. And then you'd be drowning in static sound, which would make you want to stuff your ears with shit, then listen to it for another second. I feel like static sounds exactly how it looks. Like the look is just like black, gray, white, messy, filled up, busy, and the sound is just the same, just busy and loud and saturated and just unnecessary and just why? Why must we hear this? Like, what did I do to deserve this? And also, if this happened to you late at night when no one was at home, that was the freakiest shit. Ever. Thankfully, I don't have cable anymore, so I never ever have to hear the sound anymore. But if you still do, my thoughts and prayers are definitely with you. At number four is Fred, probably the first person whose YouTube videos I avidly followed. Fred Figglehorn is a six year old fictional character portrayed by Lucas Cruikshank on YouTube. If I watched Fred now, I'd probably think it was lame as hell, but back in the day, this was my sh. And the funniest thing about Fred was his voice. Now Lucas voices him himself, but his voice is just edited to be a lot more high pitched. Like, hey, it's Fred! I'm pretty sure I didn't do that right, but just, you know, just give me some support in the comments. And the stuff he gets up to is actually hilarious. It's so clear that he's a loner who's in love with a girl who will never love him back, and he even stalks her. As cute and funny as he is, I'm not sure I'm here for a delusional 16 year old being a 6 year old stalking me at home. It's just not a cute look, and regardless of my bashing, I really did watch every single video some even multiple times. Filling our number three slot is Janice. You don't even have to have watched Friends to know what Janice's laugh sounds like, I swear to god. She's probably popped up in a YouTube video you've watched, or a meme, or Instagram, or maybe her laugh's just been haunting your dreams. Either way, the cackle on this woman is ridiculous. Imagine the human embodiment of the most annoying person you can think of, that is Janice. And her laugh sounds exactly like you think it would just by looking at her. You know when you don't like someone and you kind of hope everything they do lives up to how annoying you find them, thankfully her laugh does just that. So believe me when I say anyone who sees this picture will 100% know what it sounds like and that's not a good thing. Now at number 2 is another one. This one is probably my favourite on the list, not just because I can hear the picture in full bloody HD, but because I can hear multiple things it'd be saying in HD right now. You smart, you loyal, you grateful. I appreciate that. Or, or of course, another one. And how can I forget DJ Khaled ruining every single song that I like? And last but not least, what actually kicked off his Snapchat viralness? That's a major key to success. <laughs> this man haunts my house. I feel I'm just scared to one day go to sleep and wake up in the middle of the night with his face right in front of me telling me that sleep is a major key. I can't have that. I simply can't. I won't. I shan't. And finally, at number one is EA Sports. Guys, guys, this one symbol should strike fear in all of you. EA Sports, the creators of FIFA, NBA Live, NHL, UFC, all the sports everyone's breaking their hands playing. And when the symbol comes up on your console, that's when you know things are about to get real and personal. This is the moment you know you're about to go online and verse some 10 year old kid in Sweden who's apparently slept with your mom and dad. I swear down, my best friend used to send the most hateful messages to people who beat him on COD, and I know that's not EA, but it's still relevant. Like once someone hacked his account, and I swear this 12 year old kid was like, I'm gonna find you and kill you and your family, I can't believe you've done this, all my progress is wasted, blah blah blah, like it really isn't that deep guys, it really isn't. And that's all for today's video guys, I hope you enjoyed this sound filled, soundless journey that we just went on together. Let me know your favourite memes that you can hear because I bloody love memes, and also tell me what your favourite from this list was as well. As always, I'm Eamon Hassan and I'll see you next time. Bye!